she goes home with me. Actually, somebody read it to me over the phone. They thought that these are reins for a horse. They are not. They're not leather. I moved to Japan without knowing a single word of Japanese. I didn't know a single person, and I had no idea where I was going, but I was about to go. I started off first time when I was nine years old. First time I held a, a sword in my hand. Japanese sword, careful what you teach your kids. It wasn't Little League for me. I wasn't big and strong enough. And I worked my way up, and I worked my way up, and I moved to Japan. And I found my teacher, a, a little fella, Siyoshi. And he's Buddhist monk, not the real shit. Shaved head, the, the robe and everything. and. I auditioned and he took me on. This is what we use to hold the sword on the side of your uniform. I'm officially a 30,000 hour man. Most of this, most of it, I used on this. You can tell it's like myself, it's about ready to fall apart. And I didn't know a soul when I was there. I couldn't. I took language lessons every morning, you bet. But I took my dog, Russell. It's a cattle dog with a raccoon tail. And this, I would take it off the sword. I trained four nights a week, three hours of shit. And I would take this off the sword. And this is when I would go walk Russell with it, four in the morning. Yeah. So I take it along with me here. You guys are lifers. That's why you're here. Lifers. I saw it in your eyes. I heard it in your music. And I hear it in your hands. 30,000 hours. Hey. 